Hey everyone, get this. Berg Buna Stromberg just wrapped up an amazing season. We're talking record-breaking stuff. Their show Eine Woche voller Samstage was a huge hit with families. They had an average audience of 502 people, which is incredible. And Sissy, die Kaiserin, biggest thing they've done since 1930. The energy there is electric, folks. They're already gearing up for something even bigger next year. What makes this place so special? It's more than just the actors. And trust me, they're fantastic. It's the crew, the volunteers, everyone. They pour their hearts into it. You can feel that passion when you're in the audience. It's contagious. They've been around for ages and their love for theatre, it just keeps growing. But hold on to your hats, people, because 2025 is gonna be huge. Why? It's their 100th anniversary, a whole century of bringing stories to life. That's something to celebrate. Can you believe it? A hundred years. That's like a gazillion episodes of my show, but with way more costume changes. Berg Buna Stromberg is pulling out all the stops. We're talking big events, special performances, the works. This isn't just about looking back though, it's about looking forward. They're planning new stuff, fresh ideas, keeping things exciting. That's what's kept them going for so long. They're not afraid to try new things, and that takes guts, let me tell you. But at its core, it's about the power of theatre. That feeling you get when the lights go down, the curtain goes up, and you're transported to another world. That's magic, folks. Pure magic. And Berg Buna Stromberg? They're masters of it. OK, picture this. It's 1925. The Charleston is all the rage. Flapper dresses are everywhere. And this little theatre opens its doors for the first time. They've been through a lot. I'm talking wars, economic crashes, you name it. But through it all, the show went on. They've always aimed high, these guys. From classic plays to musicals, they've done it all. And each performance, it's like a building block, adding to their incredible story. Think of all the people who've walked through those doors, all the actors, the crew, the audience, generations connected by a love for theatre. That's powerful stuff. And it's all happened right there in this beautiful, historic theatre. You can feel the history when you step inside. It's in the walls, in the stage, even in the seats. All right, who here loves a good adventure? Berg Buna Stromberg is bringing Astrid Lindgren's Ronja Reubertochter to life. And trust me, you don't want to miss it. It's got everything. Forests, mythical creatures, the works. But at its heart, it's a story about friendship. Ronya, the daughter of a robber chieftain, becomes best buds with Burke, the son of her dad's rival. Talk about complicated. It's a story about challenging the rules, finding your own way, and realizing that friendship can bloom even in the most unexpected places. They're aiming this one at families, which I love. It's never too early to introduce kids to the magic of theatre. Plus, it's a story that will stay with you long after the curtain closes. Section 5. Yiedemann, a timeless morality. Play for modern audiences. Now, for something a little different, they're also putting on Yiedemann by Hugo von Hofmannsthal. This one's a classic, folks a real exploration of life, death, and all the stuff in between. We meet every man, just a regular guy, who suddenly has to face his own mortality. Talk about a wake-up call. It makes you think about your own life, the choices you make, the legacy you'll leave behind. Heavy stuff, I know, but that's what good theatre does. It makes you feel things, think about things, question things. This play might be old, but its message is timeless. We all grapple with these big questions, no matter who we are or where we come from. And in a world that's constantly moving, it's nice to take a moment and just reflect. Section six, more than just a stage. 
Stromberg Buna's impact on Stromberg. This theatre, it's more than just a place to see a show. It's the heart and soul of Stromberg. For a hundred years, it's brought people together. Think about it. First dates, family outings, school trips, the works. It's a cultural hub, a place where people can come together and share their love for the arts. And that's important, folks. In a world that can feel kind of divided sometimes, places like this, they remind us of what unites us. And let's not forget the economic impact. People come from all over to see these shows. They eat at local restaurants, stay in local hotels, buy souvenirs. It's a win-win for everyone. Section 7. Nurturing local talent. The Bergbooners' commitment to community. One of the things I love most about Bergbooner Stromberg is their dedication to fostering local talent. They've got this whole programme where they work with kids and teenagers, teaching them about acting, singing, directing, the whole shebang. It's not just about putting on a good show, it's about giving back to the community. These kids, they're getting a chance to learn new skills, express their creativity and build confidence. Who knows, we might be looking at the next Meryl Streep or Tom Hanks right here. And it creates this wonderful cycle. These kids, they grow up, they move on, but they remember their time at the Bergbooner. And maybe, just maybe, they come back and share their talents with a new generation. That's what community is all about. Section 8. A legacy forged in passion. Volunteers and the Bergbrunner spirit. Let's take a moment to appreciate the volunteers. These incredible people donate their time and energy because they believe in the power of theatre. They're the ones behind the scenes, building sets, making costumes, selling tickets. They're the heart and soul of this place. Without them, none of it would be possible. They're proof that passion can move mountains, or at least build a really impressive stage set. And it's not just about the work they do, it's about the sense of community they create. They're like a big family, coming together to share their love for theatre. And that energy? It spills out into the audience, making the whole experience even more special. Section 9. Looking ahead, the future of Bergbühne Stromberg. So, what's next for this amazing theatre? They're not slowing down anytime soon, that's for sure. They're already planning their next season, brainstorming new ideas and finding ways to get even more people excited about theatre. They're committed to staying relevant, to evolving with the times. Who knows what the next hundred years will bring? New technologies, new stories to tell, new ways to connect with audiences. But one thing's for sure, Bergbühne Stromberg will be at the forefront of it all. They're not just a theatre, they're an institution, and their commitment to artistic excellence and community engagement. That's what will keep them going for another hundred years and beyond. Section 10. Join the celebration. Experience the magic of Bergbühne. This is more than just a birthday party. It's a celebration of art, community and the power of storytelling. So mark your calendars for 2025 and get ready to experience the magic of Bergbühne Stromberg. Trust me, you won't regret it. And who knows, you might just discover a love for theatre you never knew you had. I'll see you there.